That's right, it's the Make Code Minute. And look, this is Make Code and I'm right inside the Make Code. So for today's Make Code Minute, what I'd like to do is talk about using an external NeoPixel strip on the Circuit Playground Express in Make Code in order to graph the light level in the room or as you cover up the light sensor. Uh, so here you can see in my Make Code session, what I have is an on start block where I set a strip to uh, a NeoPixel strip on pin A3 that has 30 pixels. If you're wondering where that is, just click on this category called light and then this NeoPixel category shows up. And right there we have set strip to and it defaults to A1, I'm moving it to A3, just for fun. So I've got that in my start loop and then in my forever loop what I've got is again under light, NeoPixel, I'm setting a strip graph and it defaults to say zero and then you can add more things to it. All I'm doing is adding instead of that zero, I'm graphing in a light level. I got that from input and if we scroll down in input, you'll see light level. So with that running on the board, check it out. I'm going to take this strip of NeoPixels and wear them like a proud bandolier and try to get out from under the make code. And then you can see as I block the light on my Circuit Playground Express, we are graphing that lightness value up and down the strip. So you can make that sound reactive, use a potentiometer, there's lots of ways to do it, but this is a really quick and easy way to do a reactive prop using Circuit Playground Express running make code. And that is today's Make Code Minute.